One of the all-time greats of Indian cricket, Pauli Umrigar was a heroic figure from the late 40s to the early 60s, almost always shining in a losing cause. Despite this, when he retired, he held the most important records, most tests, most runs, most hundreds. In fact, his record stood from 1962 to 1978 when they were broken by a certain Sunil Gavaskar. A burly six-footer, Umrigar was a commanding figure at the crease whether batting, bowling, directing operations as captain or standing in his usual position at first slip. Umrigar excelled in full-blooded drives but he could also hook and pull powerfully. As a bowler, he was an accurate of spinner and could even open the bowling, sending down outswing this. He was a brilliant versatile fielder. Either as batsman, bowler or captain, he helped shape the few Indian triumphs of his time. For 30 years he held the record of getting the highest score by an Indian on 250 to not out against Cambridge University in 1959. As a bowler, his finest hour was when he took 4 for 27 while helping India to defeat mighty Australia at Kanpur in 1959. A shrewd captain, he led India in eight tests, winning two and losing two before he resigned the captaincy at Madras against West Indies in 1959 following a misunderstanding with the selectors. He is only one of two Indian cricketers, Vinu Mankar being the other, to score a century and take five wickets in an innings a feat he achieved against West Indies at Port of Spain in 1962. Umrigal was the first Indian to hit a test double century. After retirement, he continued to serve Indian cricket as chairman of the selection committee, tour manager and BCCI executive secretary. Umrigal died in November 2006, at the age of 80, after losing a prolonged battle with lymph cancer. Pauli Umrigal debuted in test cricket against West Indies at Brabon Stadium, Mumbai, on 9 December 1948. His last test match was against West Indies at Kingston on 13 April 1962. Pauli Umrigal played 59 test matches, 94 innings, and scored 3,631 runs with a super strong batting average of 42.2. His highest score of 223 against New Zealand at Hyderabad in 1955 didn't help much as the match ended in a dull draw. He hits 12 centuries and 14 half centuries in his entire test career. As a fielder he took 33 catches. He also took 35 wickets with a bowling average of 42.08. His best bowling of 6 for 74 against Pakistan at Bahawalpur in 1955 didn't help much as the test ended in a dull draw. Pauli Umrigal had a super blockbuster first class record. He played 243 matches, 350 innings, and scored 16,155 runs with a powerful batting average of 52.28. His highest score in first-class cricket is 250 to not out. He has 49 centuries in his kitty. He also took 325 wickets in first-class cricket. His best bowling in first-class cricket is 7 for 32.